young citizens wishing to be heard, Miss Ross Perry. Yes. Please come forward, if you would, and state your name and address for the record, please. Come forward to the mic. Thank you. Good evening, My name is Marcel Rosbury. I live in the Inner Lake little community of Lake Park, and we are in dear desire of help. We pay our, the county our mileage who for the last two years came down from 8.5 to 6.5 this year. So you collect the money, but we saw you and your goodwill after a Idalia hurricane when you provide us trucks and trucks to remove the debris. It was your commitment. And I am pretty sure that the driver of the truck realized how bad was our road. It is supposedly a private community. It is not that private because we depend on you, the county. We pay, and you're supposed to be there. We don't see so much of you except the property tax. And you have changed the rule. We try very hard to have a unity, to have 100% of the people agree to turn that dirt road into a country, county road maintained by the county because it is supposed to be maintained by the volunteer, the residents, the member of the Enoch Lake Association. But times are hard. People work. They are committed to their church and to their family. And uh, when they return from work, they want to eat watch TV and go to bed. And we don't have the equipment that we cannot afford on top of that. The equipment to maintain the road, like Ziegler Road. Ziegler Road, who have about three houses and farms, is so pretty. The ditches were cut neat with water running in the ditches. We cannot afford to have the equipment. We pay 200 a year, or we're going to pay 600 a year in fees, but up to now. So, the county, I return to the point where I see you change the rule. Before, you were accepting 80% of the, the residents to agree, but now, it's really a joke to ask 100%. Even in one family, people don't agree. So how do you want to have 66 residents to agree? And it's a good thing that we agree that we have a God. Because after that, you know, we don't agree on anything. But there are already people who don't agree to pay 200 bucks, even for the light, the insurance. So how can you expect, really, to have 100% because we can really bring 80% of the residents to turn our dirt road and it is a dirt road. Even the ABS on my car has to work on that road. We cannot provide 100%. So can you made an exception so we can bring 80% of the residents and turn that dirt road into a road. Well, we don't make that decision at this point, Mr. Ross. I know. But we'll, but we'll I will, be back I will be there in two weeks, and I will be there in two weeks until you are so tired to see me. You see, I am 84, I don't work. Sure. <laughs> but God provided 
need to be a voice and receive a, 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 the voice of the community. It's, uh, they don't want it. When I ask why we don't want it, our tax will increase. No, the mileage has come down, the price of service has come up, we cannot sell them because of the economical situation, mortgage and you know, lack of money. But uh, it's, um, I say yes, but your house will gain value if you try to sell your home and the potential buyer come one day after the rain. Because uh, my neighbors behind on the alignment of your car. You have to be drunk to drive. Because you go from pothole to pothole. We have a piece of equipment who I think can go to a museum because we have a grader who doesn't read he who thinks but he doesn't read. Okay. All right. Thank you for your time and we'll You're very welcome. Yes, ma'am. Please think of that.